I got this box here from Card Kingdom. I got a nice pile, around 500, I think, 500 retro retro cards from back when I started playing Magic. So I wanted some of them back again. I got rid of a bunch of stuff when I was like in eighth, ninth grade. And so I got back into some of it. And I wanted some of the throwback stuff that I had growing up. Nice big stack here. Nice big stack. What do we got? The portal at the end. What else is on this side? Okay, so this must be the revised. There's the token. They send out usually a token. Fairy, angel, goblin, whatever. They get different ones every month. If you have any experience with Card Kingdom, I always like it. They throw in a sticker or something every now and then. But I got a nice big old stack. I mean, as you can see, it's not the best shape. They're in pretty rough shape, actually, but... Nice big pile of some old stuff. Visions, Urza's Block. I mean, is this the stuff you guys... This is the stuff you guys like? Because this is the stuff I remember growing up on. A lot of... 4th edition, revised... getting into Ice Age and Urza's and then I kind of left about 7th grade, 8th grade but this is all, I remember all these cards, these are, these are sweet, like all this old artwork is just gruesome man <laughs> just piles and piles of this that's even really old there, some dark I think that's what Tempest I think like you don't see artwork like that anymore <laughs> oh man there's some fourth or fifth fifth edition I think there's one of the starters some nice ones I mean nothing spectacular and with all of them being in this kind of poor shape the buy wasn't all that bad it was pretty cheap actually they were all around 8 12 cents a card so I just kind of loaded her up Loaded it up with all the different... Cause this is another starter set, I remember. But some of the artwork back then is just so crazy. It's like painterly. and It's kind of like an artsy portrait. Like now everything looks so digital. But... There's still people... Some of the artists are still doing actual paint pen and ink stuff it's kind of more of a dying dying art especially since all the digital stuff can be done so well I guess not quicker but the process is faster so they can kind of come out with different artwork a lot quicker they don't need to be waiting on stuff to dry and all that it's more readily available to find somebody you can do some digital artwork than oil painting and adding acrylic and pen and it's understandable I guess kind of evolves over time so all this artwork like this is just like just <laughs> a totally different style of how everything looks some of the old centaurs and elves, they look just so cool. Like all of the, like a bunch of these ones. These ones are from Mirage, I believe. And I always came in, came out, bought some packs here and there. 
then they started adding foils and I didn't really know what was going on with the foils at the time but polar foil polar rare foil back then some of them were some big bucks now I can tell you one thing especially if they're in nice condition they drop off real quick as the condition gets worse because I got yeah I remember all the Ice Age stuff for sure I came in playing went unlimited and revised for around Fallen Empires played until Ice Age dabbled in a little bit with Urza's block it got so overpowered back then though so I didn't really have the best decks being like a little 10 11 year old Ooh, it looks like we're getting some whiteboard or some revised stuff possibly these are the the reprint where they took them all from dark and antiquities and legends Arabian Nights and reprinted them I don't think I picked up any foils in this purchase but yeah so these are all the ones that I remember like these old artworks and then of course the printing processes are different depending on if you're getting revised or fourth edition these are all revised for sure but the unlimited fourth edition fifth edition they get the different marks on the bottom unlimited's got the typesets more to the left all the saturation the colors are more popping and bold but this is what i remember playing big time revised revised big old stack of revised here look at all this all multiple 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 definitely what looks to be somebody who just bought a bunch of collections and sorted everything but like I said mine was just a card kingdom buy so wasn't anything found out in the wild don't really find many cards out in the wild anymore and if they are they're all bulk commons from current sets and a lot of those token cards that people throw in and checklist cards which nobody wants why would you be throwing them in I donate that stuff. It's like donate them a VCR that doesn't work or a TV that doesn't turn on. Donate some real stuff, man. Yeah, but all these cards, man, these are just great. This is kind of stuff you guys like checking out. Leave a message or leave a comment and leave a like. Let me know what you guys want to see. I mean, I picked up a couple of couple of boxes here and there so we'll be able to get some openings for you guys if you want to see some mail openings peace